Yes, YouTube, what's going on? Coach Tommy here. And I'm doing this video, this vlog, uh, out of inspiration. I've just watched the Gary V video. Um, if you don't follow Gary V, you should. Um, he's basically, if you want to find him, he's on any social media platform that you're on. He's on 100% Gary V. And on his video, he was talking about something that he regrets. And one of his regrets is not documenting his life and his journey in business early enough when he was in the building phases. So for me, I just thought, you know what, I'll do a little vlog and an update and put it onto YouTube and it might get one one view today, but hopefully it would be good in 10 years time to look back at this video and to check in on progress that I'm making. So, you know, instead of me waiting for, you know, I'm obviously super ambitious. I want to do a lot of great things. I want to take over the world. I want my name to be household name when it comes to private football training. I want to make a, a bigger impact. Um, I want to touch as many lives as I can. Players, coaches, business owners, people, families. Um, I'm sure like many of you guys too. And, you know, instead of me waiting for good things to happen for me and then vlogging and sharing and documenting, um, I don't want to have the regret that, that Gary V's got. He's been in business a long time, a longer time than I have. So anyway, this is me vlog. For anyone who's interested, they might not be interested today, but in 10 years time, I promise you, you'll be watching this and you'll be like, you know what? That's a cool journey, hopefully anyway. Not hopefully, that that will happen. I um, don't know why I'm saying hopefully. It will happen, right? It will happen. It will happen. Um, if you believe me, leave a comment of support because I'm going to need a lot of support if I'm going to take over the world like I want to do. Anyway, this is our office space where we are running um, running our businesses out of there, Tom Owens UK. Um, superpower coaching, one-on-ones, working confidence mindset. Um, in young people and pros at all levels through training sessions on the pitch, through Zoom calls, through six-week courses. Um, and actually tonight, I've just finished uh, a, a session four of our Coach Accelerator course, which is a course for coaches who are starting, building and scaling their football training business. We've got 10 coaches from around the world. And um, and I guess I'll just share what we were talking about tonight. So the topic tonight was about dominating time. If you're a business business owner out there, you know you will already know that how you use your time is super, super important. And we were talking about the domination of time tonight. And what I was speaking on was, I think, you know, if, if you, there's certain tasks and certain activities that you should and shouldn't be doing. And when I look back on my journey over the last six or seven years, you know, there was tasks that I was doing in the early, whether it be booking sessions, responding to emails, picking up inquiries. Um, you know, as a business owner, you get caught doing these sorts of minimal tasks that you could easily dish off and box them up and give them to somebody else so that you can actually work on growing the business, work on the business instead of in the business. So that was the main topic for tonight. And I challenged the coaches in the sense of like, you know, I dare you to look at every second that you spend throughout your day. Because some of the coaches, they've got full-time jobs. I'm sure maybe some people who are watching this can relate. Ambitious, you want more money, you want to make a bigger impact, you want a, a, maybe a different career, or you're not happy with where you are right now, you're dissatisfied. But then those same people that I speak to, if they actually looked at the... These are the same people who sit around watching football matches for hours, same people who are sleeping for eight hours, same people who are spending hours and hours with family, Listen, I'm all about all these things um, because obviously they're important. Hours and hours in the gym. I love the gym. I love my family. Um, I, I enjoy sleep. And, you know, there's going to be a time and a place where maybe I increase or decrease my sleep. But, you know, if you're, if you're not happy with where you are right now in your life, you need to audit. You need to look around how you're spending every second of every day. And I guarantee you the excuses that you're making now around I've got a full-time job, I've got a million kids, uh, I've got a million bills, and I've got, like, but then you still got to find the time to watch these series on, docu on, on Netflix, and these documentaries on Netflix, and these movies, and spending hours and hours at these family events, and watching football matches for hours, and travelling to, you know, if you actually looked at how you're spending your time, I bet you that you'd be able to, you know, instead of sleeping eight hours, why don't you sleep six? Instead of being with your family for 10 hours a week, why don't you just change it to nine or eight? And I bet you if you started looking around your life and doing this and shaving some time, you would get a lot of time back. Now, the key is once you do get the time back is that you reinvest it in growth activities to actually grow your business, grow, you know, 
re-educate yourself, recreate yourself, reinvent yourself to the version that the version of yourself that you need to be for your better future. Um, so that was the topic tonight. So um, if you listen to this and you um, you found value in this, then please give me a comment. Let me know. Uh, and if not, then like I said, in 10 years time, hopefully this video will be a cool thing to look back at. Um, and I'm going to try and do a couple of more of these vlogs. But, you know, I'm ambitious. I want to take over the world. I'm going to need a lot of support to do that. Um, so if you are out there and you want to give me a comment for some support and some encouragement, I'm going to need it. So please send it over. And whatever else or other videos that you might want to see on the YouTube channel, please let me know. I'm ranting now. Uh, hopefully I get better at not ranting over the next few years. Uh, there's the caddy. I'm last in the car park. Make sure you're always the last one to leave. I'm not bragging, it's just, it is just a fact. Uh, but anyway, home now. Finish the call, home now for some food to see me baby. Um, and listen, you know, the last piece that I want to say on that is that my family know what I'm doing right now. So if I miss family events, if I'm not around for a lot of stuff with the family, they know what phase I'm in. I'm growing my business. I'm trying to grow, I'm trying to take over the world. I'm trying to touch as many lives as I can. I'm trying to do a good thing to make the world better. Um, genuinely. And my family know that. And they're on board. And they don't moan. They don't complain. They don't whine because I'm not around or I'm not at certain events. They know where I'm at. They know what I'm doing. Um, and so, you know, it's just a, a case of getting your, getting people on board to understand well, what your journey is, where you're up to. And when that happens, life becomes a lot easier. And then you can actually just focus on the activities that are going to... Um, they're going to take you towards your better future. But anyway, that's all for now. I hope wherever you are in the world, I hope that um, you receive this message um, doing well. And I hope that uh, we can work together, I can speak to you, and we can connect one day as well. That's all for now. See you later, guys. Thanks.